Magic! Oh, hello, Mimi. What's up? Um, Miss Gadget, I wanted to know if, if you could turn me into a Hellcat-like mother. Ah, uh, why this all of a sudden? Also, I think maybe you should ask Rebecca about this. She may be better at this stuff than me. I've been thinking about this ever since what happened with Mr. Silver. I felt useless while you all been fighting. I thought if I was strong like mother then maybe Mr. Silver wouldn't have gotten hurt. Also, I tried to ask Miss Rebecca, but she refuses to come out her room. I see. Well, I might have an invention that could help. Follow me. A uh, Miss Gadget! What is this? It's a gene splicer I've been working on. It's still in the big stage, but if all goes well then it can turn you into a Hellcat. Really? I can be like Mother? Yes. But before we do this you have to do one important thing. What's that? Ask your mother for permission. I like you kid but I'm not getting sent to hell for you. Fair enough. Mother, come here please. What is it me? Gadget. Do I need to kill a bitch? Mother calm down. I asked Miss Gadget to use this thing. She feels like she's not helping enough and wants to get stronger. So she wants me to turn her into a Hellcat. What? Is this true, Mimi? Yes, it is. But Miss Gadget said she needed your permission first. Okay. I allow it. I trust Gadget enough to do this. Really? Yay! Thank you, Mother. All right. Let's get started. Crystal. I'll need your help for this. I need your DNA to make this work. Just stand in the other capsule. Like this? Yes, perfect. Now hold still. If things go right then Mimi will receive your DNA and become your biological daughter and become a Hellcat. Or you may both be turned into paste. Wait, what? Gadget. You ass. You could have warned us about that last part. But if I did, you wouldn't change your mind. But look, on the bright side, you came out fine. Now we just have to wait for Mimi to come out. Fine. But if she comes out as a pile of goo, I'm gonna... Man! That was weird. Huh? Oh well! Look at me! I'm a Hellcat! It seems that it worked. This is great progress for me. Thank you, Gadget! Mother, what do you think? Mother? Can't. Breathe. Bones. Breaking. I'm... I'm so happy. I have a blood daughter. Now I'm really her mother. So... Happy. Ah, uh, that's cute. Damn it, Gadget, stop standing there and get a fucking growler! I can feel my ribs against my lungs! Hey guys, what's up? Hey girls, not much. Huh? What happened to Mimi? She's been turned into a Hellcat with one of my machines. What happened to Venom? Legal issues. Okay. Hey, where's Rebecca? She's in her room like always. Ever since you know what happened. I'm actually getting worried. She only comes out to eat and use the bathroom. Other than that, she stays in her room and refuses to come out. Maybe there's something we can do for her. Why not go out for some fun? When I'm upset, I usually go out with a guy to a bar or something. You mean a girl's night out? Hey, that sounds like fun. Me, Gadget, Crystal, and Rebecca. What say you girls? Sounds good to me. Well, I would like to, but I can't. I promised Mimi I would take her trick or treating. Unless someone wants to take my place. Candy time, baby! Top, you'll do it. Why? Because Halloween is one of the few holidays that gives out free candy. Why not go out on your own? Because I'm a grown man in a Luffy costume. I'd rather not go to jail. Well, as long as you promise to keep an eye on her, I guess it's alright. Yes. 
Maybe make sure you grab the biggest bag you have. I know where all the best neighborhoods are. They give out full-size candy bars and money. Really? I'm grabbing three bags. Uh, that's strange. I was expecting Mike to threaten me when I said money. Where is he? He's at the hospital watching Silver. I told him if something happens to give us a call. Was it a smart idea to leave a robot who do anything for money with an unconscious person? It's alright. That shows there too. I'm sure they're fine. Huh. Who is it? It's us, Rebecca. We want to talk to you. I don't feel like talking. Please. For us? Fuck off. Well, we try to chew a Bianca. Your turn, Crystal. <laughs> what the hell? Why did you do that? Because we are worried about you. We think it's time for you to get out of the room and get back to being the Rebecca we all know and love. And what better way to do that than a girl's night out? Just the four of us. No. I want to stay here in my room. And there's nothing you can do to make me leave. I can't believe you got me to join. Oh, come on. It will be fun. By the way, what club is this crystal? It's called Envy. I heard from a friend that this was a pretty good nightclub, so I thought we'd check it out. I wonder what type of electronic they use for the music. Let's just hurry so we can go home. Oh, ha, oh, ha, ha. Can you believe that happened? Yeah, you're telling me. Oh, ha, oh, ha, oh, ha, ha. Well, you seem to be in a better mood, Rebecca. Huh? Oh, yeah. You guys were right. All I needed was to get out and clear my mind. Sorry if I was mean to you guys earlier. It's cool, Rebecca. You've been through a lot since the last Necromancer attack. So it's good to kick back and have fun every once in a while. Yeah, you're right. I was just stressed out by the whole thing. But now I'm feeling a lot better. That's good to hear. Well, I'm gonna hit the dance floor for... reasons. I think I'll check out the stereo system they're using. I could use that for sound cannon. See ya, girls. Welp, I guess it's just us. Actually, I was gonna call and check up one of the guys at the house and talk to make sure they're alright. I'll be right back, Rebecca. Oh, alright. I'll just grab the drink then. Hurry back, Bianca. Well, let's see what they got. Huh? Hey, I know you. You're SD, alright? What are you doing here? Huh? Who you that too hard, girl? Rebecca, right? I'm here because the detective business is slow and we need the money. So what can I get for you? Oh, sorry to hear that. I hope work picks up soon. As for the drink, what is the lowest alcoholic drink you have? Thanks for that. I needed to hear that. As for the drink, the weakest one we have is some whiskey. Is this your first time drinking? Well, kind of. I never really drank much. Maybe one or twice before. Well, in that case, I'll just give you a shot of whiskey. Give me a few minutes. Damn. They alert. Hey there, sexy. What brings you here? Huh? Oh, not much. Just looking to have some fun tonight. If it's fun you want, then maybe I could provide it. Oh, really? What type of fun did you have in mind? That depends on what type. You're looking for. Hehe, <laughs> I like where this is going. Join me on the dance floor and maybe you will see how far you can get. So far you've made it to second base. Who knows, you may get to fourth base by the end of the night. You're on. We made a really good haul, right, Mimi? Yeah, I never made this much candy before. I know. Just look at these things. But I think it's about time we head home. Yeah, you're right. Trick for treating is about over. So let's go. Hey guys, we're home. Huh? What's going on here? Hey guys, just playing some blackjack. 
You guys wanna join? Hell yeah. Feel me in. I've seen Mother play this game before. I think I know the rules so I'll play as well. Alright. Venom deal them in. Maybe we'll go easy on you and won't bet anything until you get the hang of it. Alright. Thanks guys. Okay everyone gets two cards. Maybe you go first. Would you like to draw? Hit me. Wait. Hey I got 21. I win. Damn that was quick. Let's go another round. Let's bet as well. I'm feeling lucky. You wanna start betting now huh? Alright. But just know you won't hold back. Bring it. Well that was fun. So did I make it to fourth base? I say about three and a half. Ha ha ha. Are you teased? Huh? That's strange. I could have sworn this is where my friends were. Oh god, please tell me you're not even friends! Huh? Eskio? What demon are you talking about? That girl named Rebecca! She's a monster! What happened to her? I gave her two shots of whiskey and the next thing I know she starts shooting fire at me and calling it fireworks! I almost died! Crystal, here you are! We have a problem with Rebecca! Come on! Damn it! I was so close to fourth race! Now I have to deal with this. Sorry, but I got to go. Ah, I never got your name. The name's lost, and it's cool. Go check on your friend. I'm usually here every Friday and Saturday if you wanna see me again. Rebecca, get the fuck down. No, I want to be Tarzan. Rebecca, I swear to God I will shoot you in the knees if you don't get the hell down from there. Okay, so what the hell is going on here? Rebecca got drunk and started going haywire. Wait, she got drunk from two shots of whiskey? God, she must have a low alcohol tolerance. Wait. Only two shots. She's acting like she drunk three bottles straight. It's hot in here. And get down so we can go. Oh my god! Rebecca, put your clothes back on! Yep. Keep in that. Freedom. Now to save Narnia. Everyone after her! Dude, did you see that naked chick run past? Hell yeah, dude! Man, I should've took a picture! She was so hot! Excuse me, have you seen a naked green girl run past here? Damn! More hot chicks! Will you answer the question? H&M. Maybe we did or maybe we didn't. If you show us some action, then we might tell you. Really? Alright, fine. Crystal, show them some action. Is this enough action for you? Um... Actually, I think we remember seeing a girl run towards the park. Please don't kill us. Thank you for the info. Later, scumbags. Damn it! We've been looking for hours and yet no sign of her. Maybe they gave us false information. Crystal, is that you? Huh? Lust? What are you doing here? I was on my way home when I saw you and your friends. Are you looking for something? We're looking for Fred. Was she a green girl with no clothes on? Yes, that's her. Where is she? Last I saw her she was heading for that tall building over there. Thanks for the info, Lust. No problem. Hope you find your friend. Finally, we found you. Come on and let's go home, Rebecca. Rebecca? I'm a monster, aren't I? I killed all those people without any sign of remorse. And everyone who knows me gets hurt or killed. Why am I cursed to be this way? To have the blood of a ghoul hog in my veins? I'm... I'm... I'm just like Zeno aren't I? A cold-blooded demon. I hate being a ghoul hog. I... I wish I was never born. I... I... I just want to... Disappear. Rebecca! Let's see! Fifty million dollars, Sonic's life supply of chili dogs, tops Nintendo Switch and Slide Soul. And now Shadow is getting the deed to the house.
Yep, I say this has been one of the best Halloweens ever. Goddamn. You guys are getting wrecked by a child. Shut the fuck up, Venom. I'm trying to win all our stuff back. I bet my soul trying to win it back shadow and lost it. Literally lost it. It came out my body and everything. Dude, you're screwed. Shadow, please quit while we still have a roof over our head. Shadow, please. I don't have anywhere else to live. Shut up, all of you. I have a good feeling about this one. Are you sure about that, Shadow? Are you that confident that you will beat me? Or are you just trying to make yourself feel better about your upcoming defeat? I... 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 I thought so. I think it's about time to end this. Venom. Hey guys, we're back. Maybe time for bed. Oh, thank God! Ah. Uh, how sad. I was so close to winning. Well, maybe next time, guys? Please go away. Well, that was a pretty hectic night, huh? You're telling me. Hey, where's Rebecca? She's in the shower. What's up, bitches? Light! What are you doing here? Simple. To make sure this guy got back safe. Hey, guys! Silver, you're back. Yep. The doctor said I'll be fine as long as I don't lose any more blood. Um... Light. What happened to your head? Echo hit me with her hammer. I think she messed up my vision sensors. Everything's a blur right now. Sigh. I'll catch you up later. Anyway, where's Rebecca? Oh, she just can be. Has anyone seen my towel? Sigh. I'll call an ambulance. <laughs>